Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Welcome back to F122, my team career mode. For the f rest of season four, I'm going to go all out. I'm going to do all of the last seven races in this video, hopefully. Uh, and without further ado, here we go. Uh, I don't think I'm going to show qualifying up until the final race. Uh, so yeah, uh, here we go. Here we go for the Hungarian Grand Prix. It's lights out and away we go. And it is a decent start. Which is rightfully screwed by the McLarens. That was very annoying, Lando. Get out of here, Ricardo. You don't belong here. I hope I didn't throw this win away. Knowing Budapest, I probably did. This circuit is prone to causing my car to get stuck to the curves. And the AI just being flat out better than me. I don't know. Who knows? Maybe we'll catch up to uh, Schumacher. The car, guys, the car, t higher temperatures, come on. Ah. Yo! Okay, the car... Ugh. Tire temperatures! Come on! Guys, this is ridiculous. Tire temperatures! Mark, you're the one who... I'm going to tell you to shut up. I don't even want to do it politely, but the game forces me to be polite. Mark, 
you are the one who dictates the tire temperature. And guess what? You keep on putting it too high. So the car slides around. Ugh. Putting the tire temperatures too high, Mark, and it's making it way too difficult to race. That's it. Nope, I'm restarting this again. Twice. I am pissed. This is bullshit. I'm sorry that you guys are seeing this. Mark, I am going to mute you. You piece of fuck. Two McLarens don't deserve to be up here. And you, Michael, don't deserve to be up here. Look at you, already being attacked by the two McLarens. Fuck off. Championship's mine. These race wins are mine, and you will not be on this team next season. That is a guarantee. Only reason I'm not punning you off, you son of a bitch, is because I still want this Constructors' Championship. And we have a chance to win it here if we get a 1 2. Keep getting on and off, we'll see what happens.
What the fuck do you think you're doing? Huh? Think I'm going to give you free DRS? Not gonna happen, you son of a bitch. No! Fucking curve! I want to see that really quickly because I swear to God that the curve caught my car. It did. If I go wide and lose the lead, I have no issue with it right there like that but when it's the curb catching my car I have a major issue with it because I have no way to defend that's why I hate Budapest Oh, fuck, what a... S stupid fest. This first race. I hope the next one goes s smoother. Holy fuck. We have won the Constructors Championship.
Championship League. Let's focus on the driver of the day. Natalie Bingham, come on, who do you pick? I have to give it to Martin. They fought so hard and had incredible pace at times, so I don't think anyone did a better job today. With that result, the sport's newest team could no longer be touched at the top of the table. What an incredible journey this has been for a team many have written off a short time ago. They are the Formula One World Champions. Here we go for the Belgium Grand Prix. <coughs> it's lights out and away we go. It's a good launch on for us over Schumacher. Lando Norris trying to squeeze past. The McLaren of Lando Norris up to P2. However, here comes Schumacher up to Royal Rouge. Slight contact made with our teammate. Lando Norris punts us into the wall. That was dirty. That was dirty, Lando. Oh, fuck. Well, at least this time I was able to save it. Ugh. You guys are scaring me. Excuse me. Check out. <coughs> <coughs> Michael, do not let him, that McLaren, win. start mate I had a fantastic start that just got uh, slapped away by the McLaren of Lando Norris I feel like he shouldn't got he should have gotten a penalty for that but I know he wasn't he is he doesn't have one so. off goes Albon however if we're not really close enough and Leclerc doesn't go for it, so we can't follow Leclerc through. Oh, we're going to dive the shit out of both of them. Come on, Maiko. Oh, Roosh just isn't fast for me. I don't know what it is, but the car doesn't feel straight through a rouge. Catching Max, sort of. God, it is so weird seeing the 33, number 33 on the Mercedes. We made the pass on Verstappen. However, Max not too keen on that. And up further uh, up the road is Schumacher versus Lando. Side by side for the two up front. Schumacher doesn't stick with it like he should have. So that means I have to go for it. Like usual. You suck. 
I don't care if you're a seven time world champion. As my teammate, you suck. Here we go then on Lando. Kinda wanna take revenge out on him, but I'm not going to. And swing across his uh, front wing. <coughs> Show him that way, that I'm annoyed. Michael makes a move on Lando and it uh, worked. Actually, I think Lando might have had a issue or something because he is uh, closer to Verstappen uh, than he is to Schumacher. Max may have a shot at getting Lando. I don't think Max will get a podium, but be cool to see uh, Max on the podium again, especially if he uh, beats Lando for it. Four. Final lap here in the Belgium Grand Prix.
welcome to my victory. Here we go for the Dutch Grand Prix here in Zambort. It's lights out and away we go. Great start from us as we already launch ahead of our teammate. And we go off. Just slightly. This is Max Verstappen's home Grand Prix, and I must say, it will be his last. Max Verstappen will be retiring after this season. He came forward in front of his Dutch home crowd. Trying to appease to them with a podium. Lando Norris goes off. And we did kind of push him a little bit, but not enough to force him to have to peel off the road. Now, all over the back of Verstappen. Left the door open, and we went for it. Now, chasing after Michael Schumacher. Oh, fuck. Went too deep. Went for a gap, and it closed. I had nowhere to go. That's what I'm talking about by getting stuck on the fucking curb. I might have to stop this video earlier than I expected. I was looking the other way. I may have to end this video early. Uh, I'll try to finish this race. But I think after Zanfort, I'm going to call it uh, Duns on this video when we make contact with Schumacher. And that puts him into the gravel trap. Schumacher goes down out of the top five. He's going to the back of the grid. <coughs> Now, Verstappen is here, up into P2, and he's hungry for the win. He's there, 
I can't really stop him. He he's a hungry Dutch driver at his home Grand Prix. There's not much I can do. Verstappen takes to the lead of the race. The other German manufacturer. Less than a lap and a half left in this Grand Prix. Can we... Can we put one last stick it to Max? Or can he show his home crowd that he is still worth something even though he's leaving the sport at the end of the season? Last lap of the Grand Prix, wasn't much I could do in turn one. Mercedes haven't won a race yet in this career mode. Could Verstappen bring them their first? I really do not think Mercedes won a race this career mode yet. Here we go. Fin <coughs> final few opportunities. Did we get him? He's still to our inside. He gets the better, the better traction out of the corner. Through the final corner, contact made. Verstappen's going to win his home Grand Prix in spectacular fashion and bring Mercedes their first race win. As the first time that my team has not won a race this season. Verstappen wins in Zamvort once again. Brings 25 points to his name and to the Mercedes attempt for the Constructors Championship. So Michael ended up finishing P11, still no points for him, and we pull uh, another 19 points ahead. I think we could win it in uh, Italy, but who knows. Uh, mm. Nonetheless, uh, 
Max Verstappen wins his home Grand Prix once again and brings Mercedes a race victory.